Hey guys, Fun and Neutral. I wanted to do a really quick video of an accessory I just added to my XD250. It's a, it's a pretty cool accessory, and um, I was a little bit um, unsure if I wanted to do this because I wasn't sure how it was going to mount up. I didn't want it to look stupid, and plus I wanted it to mount good and not all hokey. And I think it kind of worked out, so let's check it out. It's going to be the dry spec tool tube. I'm uh, really excited about it because it really mounted up a lot easier than I thought it would be. I was kind of dreading having to drill stuff and all that. I'm hoping there's not a bunch of wind. If there is, I'm sorry. It uh, picked up out of nowhere. So I got this from Twisted Throttle. And it kind of speaks for itself. It's a tool tube and it's waterproof. The, the items I had to get to make it mount up were a little mounting kit. And you can see the brackets. There's one here. And it came with its own hardware. What I did up under here, it's going to be hard for me to show you, but it's, it's basically this handle's bolt I sandwich this bracket with a longer bolt and it, it fit right up no problem just sandwiched it now you can see it's very adjustable and this hardware came with the bracket kit so I was able to use this and make it work and in the back believe it or not there's a um, there's a little hole up in here where the turn signals go where they connect to the bike there's a hole in this mount that fit perfect for the hardware to go in might be able to show you right there and without burning my hand right there you can see the back side how it mounted up And you could see up here where it's mounted up in there using the hardware. It's very adjustable. You see I have it on the, the setting up here is three holes. I use the top one. I did that so it'd be kind of symmetrical with the way it looked with my exhaust. It doesn't look, you know really goofy looking or eye-catching so it's kind of windy so I'm gonna tuck down a little bit behind the bike to talk about what the things are called so it's a, a dry spec tool tube kit includes storage tube and um, mounting hardware and then I bought a side rack accessory mounting kit for the S and W Motec side racks. That's these bits right here. Strangely enough, these mounting hardware were $24, which was way more than the tube itself. I think the tube was like $16. Yeah, so this little, so you get two brackets and... Um, you get two brackets, two screws, two nuts that are the ones that are self-locking, and a couple washers for 24 bucks. And I, I really was not going to get that. I, I said that's a ripoff. But in hindsight, I'm glad I did because I didn't have to do any drilling. I got it all from Twisted Throttle in one order. And here's the best part. I saved the best part for last. And you're really going to love this best part because being that the XT250 doesn't have the biggest gas tank in the world, this right here is really awesome. This too, by the way, the thing I'm about to take out of here was cheaper than the bracket. I got me one of those fancy 
MSR fuel cans and it it's um, 30 ounces and it fits perfectly in that tool tube check that out perfect really cool it's my first fuel can I ever bought for a bike and this locks on there good I read the reviews on those fuel cans and if you are mindful of the rubber seal it uh, shouldn't leak but if it leaks in here this is also sealed as well, so it shouldn't leak out all over your bike. I believe this is reflective too. I'm not 100% positive, but you can see how I'm wiggling it. That was another worry that the mount would suck. It's on there solid, definitely. I used a little bit of Loctite on that bolt up in here. And you definitely need a longer bolt up here to make this work. You could take what you have off of here and take it to the hardware store and get a longer one. And um, you're going to need more length on the back. I'm not sure if I can show you how much it protrudes out, but there it is right there. You probably don't need that much length, but I wanted to make sure I had enough. Well, that's it. I'm trying to keep this quick. Dry tech tool tube. I'll put the item numbers in the description the links and I hope this isn't all super windy if it is I apologize I just wanted to share that with you guys because it's ironic I got a fuel can with fuel doing what it's doing now in the world I may want to go ahead and fill that up now before the prices get even higher all right catch you guys later see ya